Many startups first look to friends and family members as their first stage of outside investment. But what's important to remember is that for the sake of the business and the personal relationships, it is just as important to draft an investment contract with friends and family members as it is for any other type of investor. The contract should be specific, and it should specify the amount of the investment, the rate of return, and any current or future ownership arrangements that may be part of the agreement. So we're talking about mom, dad, rich uncle Bob <laughs> investing right, in right. our companies, right? Yes. And I and I would assume that we're talking about relatively small amounts at this point, maybe thousands or tens of thousands, but unlikely to be hundreds of thousands of dollars, right? I think that's right. But from a legal standpoint, it, it needs to be taken just as seriously as if you were asking well, – just as seriously for asking for a $1,000 investment as if you were asking for a $100,000 investment.